Juhudi za naibu jaji mkuu Filomena Mwilu kujiondoa kutoka kwa minyororo ya ufisadi hii leo zilipata mwanga. Baada ya mahakama kuu kutoa uamuzi kwa kesi hiyo isitishwe mara moja. Wakili wa Mwilu wapatao 32 akiwemo seneta wa CIA James Orengo na aliyekuwa makamu rais Kalonzo Msyoka wakipinga kuendelea kwa kesi hiyo ambapo Mwilu anakabiliwa na mashtaka kadhaa ya kuwemo kukwepa kulipa ushuru pamoja na kumumunya mamilioni ya pesa kutoka benki iliyofilisika ya Imperial. That these proceedings are an abuse of the process of the court. And you are a magistrate you are expected to pay respect to a high court judge or judge of court of appeal or judge of Supreme Court. You are being put in a very embarrassing position. You are dealing with a person of the next in command of the entire judicial system. The first accused may not be called upon to take a plea at this stage. Hata hivyo kizaza kilizuka kotini baada ya mawakili wa mwili kuwasilisha uamuzi uliotolewa na jaji Chacha Mwita. Hata hivyo ulikuwa na makosa. Uamuzi huo ukitupiliwa mbali na Hakimu Lawrence Mugambi hadi siku ya Ijumaa makosa yatakaporekebishwa. Ni uamuzi uliompa mwili afueni angalau ya muda mfupi. Hatma ya naibu jaji mkuu Filomena Mbete Mwilu sasa ipo mikononi mwa zaidi ya mawakili 40 watakao kwa ruzana siku ya Ijumaa Hakimu Lawrence Mugambi atakaposikiza kesi hiyo Steven Letoni kiripotia runinga ya Citizen Nairobi